You're in love with Chuck. Yeah, right. Oh, hey, wait a minute. I know who you are. You're Eden Capwell. Am I? Yeah, I think... Oh. Eden! Oh, I yeah. can't believe it! How are you? Oh, you've come home. Oh, Eden! Daddy? Oh, Eden. <laughs> is it really you? Yes, it is. Oh, thank you, love. Kelly? Hello, Eden. Welcome home. Ted? Thanks for you. Come here. My pleasure. Hey, how's it going? Woo! Woo! Heavens, you look wonderful. She certainly does. You look great. I'm not visiting. I'm planning on staying. I'm sorry to disappoint you, Eden, but I'm glad it's going to be. December 21st, 1988. You were working at London's Heathrow Airport as a station manager for Libyan Airlines. You cut a lock on the service entrance of the Terminal 3 interline baggage shed, and you transferred one hard shell suitcase packed with a Semtex bomb onto a 747 bound for New York. Who are you? I'm just a son whose mother and father were murdered on Pan Am 103. Like a you know, a few years ago they said that soap operas were dead, and reports of our deaths have been greatly exaggerated. And I know that I speak for everyone at The Young and the Restless when I say we are proud to stand shoulder to shoulder with Days of Our Lives, General Hospital, and The Bold and the Beautiful. Arrogant, but brilliant. Dysfunctional but protective, eccentric but impulsive, and a bad boy but with a heart of gold. Those are some descriptions of the characters played by the nominees for Outstanding Lead Actor in a Drama Series. Take a look. And the Emmy goes to Anthony Geary as Luke Spencer.